Creating a preset is incredibly easy inside On One Photo Raw. Simply open up a photo and make some adjustments to it, and then you can save those adjustments as a preset. So if we take a look at this photo's adjustments, inside our Develop tab here, we've modified our tone and color quite a bit using these different sliders. If I go into my Effects tab, I've added some different filters to stylize the shot. And lastly, I've added a new local adjustment layer, and if I go into my masking options, and I view my mask, I've used a local adjustment gradient to mask this in on the top of my photo. I can also view all of these settings applied to my photo by going up into my info pane here, and in the settings applied drop-down menu, I can see all of the adjustments I've applied to my photo. So now if we want to save these settings as a preset, we can just head up to our top bar, and in the settings menu, we'll go down and we'll just choose save settings as preset. And now inside the save preset dialog, we can choose all of the different adjustments that we want to include in the preset. I can see all of my develop settings here. And in my effects and local adjustments, I can choose to have those masks applied in my preset. I'm going to choose this apply masks for my local adjustments so that I keep that adjustment at the top of my photo. Now I'll just name the preset local at top. And if I use this drop down menu here and go all the way up, I can add a new category for my presets. And I'll just name them favorite landscapes. Now I can click Save, and if I head over to my preset browser, I have this new Favorite Landscapes category with my Local at Top preset here. But what if we want to modify a preset? Maybe there's an older preset that we want to update with some current settings, or maybe there's a preloaded preset inside PhotoRAW that we want to modify and adjust for our liking. Well, let's just head back into our preset browser and I'll go into this preloaded landscape preset category. And one of my favorite presets in here is this nice daily vitamin. I'm just gonna click on it to apply it to my photo. And I really like how that works with my shot, except I don't really like all of the detail it's applying and I do wish it was a little bit more warm. So I'm just gonna head into my effects tab here and I'm gonna find the filter that's applying the detail. I know it's not this color enhancer filter, so let's head into our tone enhancer, and you'll see that all of that detail is being applied by this clarity slider being pulled up to 50. So if I turn this tone enhancer off and on, you'll see it removes all of that detail from my photo. Well, I'll just exit out of this tone enhancer, and I'll go into my color enhancer, and I'll just warm the photo up a bit to bring back some of that warm color. So now that I've modified this preset, I can either save these settings as a current preset by doing the steps we did earlier, or I can head over to my preset browser and I can right click this preset that I'm working on, and I can update the preset with the current settings. So now with this update preset dialog, I can choose all of the settings that I want to update for this daily vitamin preset. Well, I know I don't want any develop settings and I don't want any local adjustments, I only want my effect settings so that I have that detail removed from the tone enhancer and that color warmth increase with my color enhancer. So now I can just click update and I've updated that preset with those settings that I wanted. So that's how easy it is to create and modify presets inside On One Photo Raw 2019.5. I'm Dylan with On One and stay tuned for more.